If you have a iBuyPower PC with a Gigabyte motherboard model B660, DS3H, AC, DDR4-Y1, and you can't find the BIOS update for it, this video is for you. Hey everybody, this is Corey with Corey's Computer Repair, and I'm here to tell you that little dash Y1 at the end just really messes things up, doesn't it? It's confusing. You go to Gigabyte's website, you look for the BIOS update, they have this model board, except it doesn't have the hyphen Y1 or the dash Y1 at the end. Well, I'm here to tell you that is simply iBuyPower's little mark to let everyone know that they have their iBuyPower splash screen when you first turn the computer on. Really, that is the only difference between the one without the dash Y1 and the one with. So I'm here to tell you if you go to Gigabyte's website and you look at for the model, take off the Y1. Strictly look for B660 DS3H AC DDR4 and download that BIOS update. That specific update is going to work fine. There is no problems with it. Uh, if you look here, at the time of writing, the most current version is F21. The most current BIOS revision is version F21. So you're gonna download that and you're gonna load it in the Q flash and look what it says here. It added the dash Y1. So I've already done this BIOS update a handful of times on other systems for the same board, but I'm gonna bring you along here and let you watch it update and I will be back as soon as it's done. All right, BIOS update complete and successful. We're gonna reboot now and here's the difference. You're gonna see the Gigabyte logo and not the iBuyPower logo. And I'm gonna go ahead and go into the BIOS to verify 100% the update took. And as you can see here in the top left corner, BIOS version F21. At the time of recording, this is the latest BIOS for this motherboard. So now I'm just simply gonna exit the BIOS. I'm gonna reboot the system and just verify it boots up to the login screen and the customer is going to be really happy. So let's restart here. And the computer is rebooting right now and we should get the Gigabyte logo. There it is right there. That's the new splash screen instead of the iBuyPower. Got the little spinning circle, so that's good. Looking good so far. We just wanna verify we get to that screen with the time and the Windows background and yep here we go and then all the customer has to do is hit enter to log in i'm not going to do that for privacy reasons but once again this is corey for corey's computer repair i hope this video helps somebody out there to update the bios on their iBuyPower power machine and you guys have a wonderful day thank you for watching